How is it to go? What now out today, everybody? This is Jordan Jones. I'd like to share you guys my top 10 favorite Wii games. I know my old top 10 favorite Wii games that I've already done earlier this year might be outdated now. That's why uh, that's why I'm redoing another top 10 of it. So if you guys give me a favor and drop a like on the video, I'd really appreciate that. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click on that subscribe button and click on the bell right beside it. Be notified every time my new videos come out and have a good. And without further ado, let's go. All right, so number 10 on my list is Wii Sports. This game started off with the Wii. It has five sports, tennis, baseball, bowling, golf, and boxing. All of them are really fun to play. And stuff like that. And this is just a really fun game to play. And it's just super fun. And, and this game started it all for the Wii. And it takes advantage of the Wii's motion controls. Like it really does. It's the only Wii game that runs at 30 FPS. Since the other Wii games run at 60 FPS. This is the only Wii game that runs at 30 FPS. Since the other ones run at 60 FPS. And it's a really, really nice game. So that's all I have to say about this game. So now moving on. Number nine on my list has to be New Super Mario Bros. Wii. The reason why this one has to be number nine on my list is because, um, of course it's a Mario game. And I love the Mario franchise so much. I just love the Mario franchise so much. And this game definitely has to be one of my favorite Wii games. So that's why it's number nine on my list. And I love how you have the propeller suit and stuff, and you can use it to fly through the game. And that's what I really like about this game. So you can do that. And it's just really, really fun. And that's how the propeller suit works. Now I'm gonna show you how the penguin suit works because propeller and penguin suits are the two suits that added to this game along with the ice flower. Yes, the ice flower wasn't some Mario Galaxy first, but wasn't in 2D Mario game till this game. All right, so now I wanna show you how the penguin suit works. So here's how the penguin suit works. You can belly slide with it. You can, uh, it prevents you from slipping and sliding on the ice, so it can be really helpful. And I love how the penguin suit works. And stuff like that. So it's really cool. Yeah. Darn it. Excuse me. And this game's a really, really fun game. And one thing I love about Mario games, how they make all their Mario games accessible to everybody. And stuff like that. And there we go, so that's what I love about the Mario's franchise and stuff. And there we go. That's all I have to say about this game, so now moving on. Number eight on my list has to be Wii Sports Resort. The reason why this one's number eight on my list is because it has more sports. It's the sequel to Wii Sports, and it has more sports. And they're even more fun. And it requires Wii Motion Plus. And 
it runs at 60 FPS. <clears throat> I especially love the island flyover mini game on this. And it's just really fun. A lot of these sports are really, really fun to play and stuff like that. And the graphics are great. Gra especially on my smart TV, since I'm playing on a smart TV, it makes it look even better. <clears throat> like it really does. And it's just really, really awesome. Like it really is. That's how awesome it is. Like it really is. It's just so awesome. And this game has lots of really awesome sports you can play and stuff like that. Like the sports are super duper awesome to play and stuff like that. That's really all to say about this game, so now moving on. Number seven on my list happens to be Mario Kart Wii. The reason why this one's number seven on my list is because really good graphics. It's a really fun racing game to play on the Wii and stuff like that. Like it really is. The tracks are awesome. Uh, and stuff like that. And then this one's really, really fun to play. I, especially this track. The reason why Koopa Capes has always been one of my favorite tracks in this game. Because I've always loved water levels in video games, of course. So this one's definitely really fun. And, if you're in, and then this game ha, ha, takes advantage of driving a real car. Takes advantage of the motion controls. Like it really does. Like it really does take advantage of that. And that's all to say about this game. So now moving on. Number six. Six on my list has to be Pac-Man Party. Why this is number six? It's just a really awesome Wii game. It's always been one of my favorites ever since I've uh, first had it. And the mini games are so much fun as well. Especially this pizza mini game where you're throwing pizza in the area is really, really fun to play. It's just super awesome. Like it really, really is. Stuff like that. All these mini games are really awesome for the most part. And the adventure in this game is so much fun. And stuff like that. And it's just really awesome. And this game is super duper awesome. Like it really is. And that's all to say about this game, so now moving on. Number five on my list happens to be Punch Out for the Nintendo Wii. The reason why this one is number five on my list is because I've always loved this game. I grew up with it as a child, and it's just really, really awesome. And it's of course, one of the best Punch-Out! games you can ever play, and it's one of the best video games you can ever play, as well as one of the best Wii games you can ever play. And the personality of this game is amazing. Like, if you've never played this game, definitely check it out. Like, it's really that amazing. Like, it really is. And you learn strategies, and you must learn your opponents, and you will take the time to master this game. And, and defend your belt in tall defense mode to become the greatest of all time. And then... And then... Opponents get harder and harder as it goes on. And that you will find yourself... Which, with, each, with, with each passing challenge, with each passing opponent, and the character design is really amazing. And stuff like that. It's just 
is that amazing? Like it really is. And that's all I have to say about this game, so now I'm moving on. Number four on my list has to be Batman the Brave and the Bold for the Nintendo. It has to be Batman the Brave and the Bold for the Nintendo Wii. The reason why this one's number four on my list is because it just really is. Because I grew up with this game as a child, and of course it's really, really awesome to play. And I love the level design in this game because it's just fantastic. Because I love how fantastic the level design is in this game. Like, it's really one of the best 2D platformers that you can play on the Wii. Like it really is. And it's just that awesome. And you get to play as Batman, Guy Gardner, Robin, Hawkman, and Boy Beetle. There's a huge gap between those with power and such a Sinestro. That's what you get when your planet's run by a madman. And then... And then there we go. The soundtrack is amazing in this game. So, so is the level design. And I just love how awesome it is. It's just that awesome. And it, and it just has awesome level design, awesome music, and deep imagination with the level designs. Like it really does. All the levels are fun to play in this game. There's not a single level I dislike. And the controls are so fluid. And in this game, you try to stop crime, kind of like what Batman did in the Batman movies. I never really watched the Batman movies, but I love this game. You can shake the way about the nunchuck for the superpower, or you can press the one button to do this. Or you can press the one button to use your superhero. And or to use your assist, which is your jumping hero. The game is just amazing. Like it really is. That's why it's high on the list. That's why it's this high on the list. That's why the that's why it's number four on the list. That's why it's really high on the list. Because it has a really good amount of level variety and stuff in comparison to other platformers on the Wii. And then if you press the one button, you can do this. In this game, you will enjoy the level design. You will really enjoy everything in this game. It's just that amazing. If you never played this game, check it out. Definitely check it out for your week. Definitely check it out if you never played it, because it has a really good personality to this game. Like it really does. That's why it's, it's as high as it is on the list. That's why it's really high on the list. And you have these elevators you have in some levels you have to ride on and stuff like that. This, this game is definitely way better than the Batman movies. Like it really is. It's just awesome. That's how awesome this game is. And, and it's very acrobatic. I love how acrobatic this game is. Speedrunning, and I love speedrunning this game, 
and it's awesome. And it's just so awesome like that. Look at all the level design stuff. Look at how awesome it looks. Check out the ocean view. It's the Asnaclip Sea. And then you ju it's just awesome like this. In this great or what? In this game great or what? It kind of gives me some references to um other video games, and that's great. Like it really does. And it's just really great. I appreciate you, Clint. I'm sure you will be like our And that's all to say. And that's all to say about this game, so now moving on. Number three on my list happens to be Donkey Kong Country Returns. Why this one's number three on my list. Pretty good reason. Pretty good reason why it's number three. Amazing game. Amazing game. The game is amazing. The game has awesome level design and really good amount of level variety. And I love how Diddy Kong's so helpful in hard levels. Because he has the hover ability, and you can roll like this. You can blow. You can. You can roll. You can ground pound. And listen to his music. And then greater what? Like, like this game is awesome. Like it really is. You, you were surprised to see it this high on the list. You might have been surprised to see this game this high, but but this game is amazing. It's one of the best 2D platformers ever. And look at how awesome this is. The music is so chill and laid back. You won't believe how awesome this game is. That's why it's really high on the list. And only two Wii games top it. But we'll talk about those later. And this game is very acrobatic. Diddy Kong in this game kind of acts like the ho the hover nozzle. It kind of acts like Flood in Super Mario Sunshine. And that's all to say about this game. So now moving on. Number two on my list has to be Super Mario Galaxy 2. Why Super Mario Galaxy 2 is number two on my list. You expected it to be this high. Because I I love the 3D Mario games. I love the 3D Mario games more than 2D. Like they're really amazing. Like you was expecting this game to be this high on the list. Like you really was. Cause awesome level design like really 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 awesome level design for some reason my pointer's not okay so i think my pointer's working better now um i think it's my tripod that's in the way of the pointer let me move it a little bit that it should be better now should be why is my pointer not working the way it usually does? There we go. I think it's working just fine now. I think it's 
the table that my tripod sits on is getting in the way. But the my, let's talk about the main reason why this is one of my favorite Wii games ever. It even has my favorite Mario power-up, which is Cloud Mario. And with Cloud Mario... And with Cloud Mario, you can create your own platforms. Like you really can. It's just awesome. And you can... That's why Cloud Mario is my favorite Mario power-up of all Mario games. Because you can create your own platforms. Also, this game is my second favorite Mario game. And only one Mario game will top this. And, it, and it's actually on the same console as this game. And you have Comet Medals you collect in this game. This game's the sequel to Super Mario Galaxy. You have Cosmic Clones in some levels. You have Star Chips you have to collect in some levels to make launch stars appear. Like you really do. The controls are perfect, pretty much. Like. And everything about this game. And I love Yoshi in this game. Because you can use Yoshi in this game in some levels. And he's really acrobatic. And I just love level design in this game. And I love how much level variety you have in this game. That's why it's this high on the list. So, that's why it's this high. And, it just has really awesome level design. Like it really does. It's hard to believe how awesome level design is in this game. And now we'll talk about my favorite Wii game. So here we go. All right, you've guessed it right. Super Mario Galaxy absolutely has to be number one. The reason why this game has to be number one is because it's my favorite Wii game, as well as my favorite Mario game, and one of my favorite video games of all time. Level design is amazing in this game. This is the best Wii game ever. Like, it really is. At least that's just my opinion, but... I love how fluid the controls are, and I love how good level design is in this game. Like, it's just really, really amazing. It's just, nothing comes close to how amazing this game is. That's how amazing it is. No other Wii game even comes close to how amazing this game is. If I had to pick my four favorite platformers on the Wii, that would have to be um, this game, Galaxy 2, Donkey Kong Country Returns, and Batman the Brave and the Bold. Platforming, platforming wise, this is the best platformer on the Wii. Um, Because it's just a really, really fun Wii game to play. Like it really, really is. Like it really, really is a really fun Wii game to play. It's just amazing. Especially with level design. <laughs> Like it really is. Um, 
And of course, you have different types of level designs here. You have a really good level variety here, and that's great. That's amazing. No other Mario game and no other Wii game comes close, comes close to how amazing the Galaxy games are. Like, they are really amazing. Like, they're so amazing. And they have really good level design and stuff. And they're so amazing. And, like, this game tops all 2D and 3D Mario games. And it tops all Wii games as well. Like it really does. So. Like it really does. Like it really does. This is really, really awesome. It's just super duper awesome, actually. And you can see how amazing level design is in this game. And everything about the game. Look at it. Look at how amazing this game is with level design. I like how this game has a bit more exploration than what Super Mario Galaxy 2 does. Because I'm not going to lie, Galaxy 2 is very linear. Uh, and in this game, the environments are so much bigger, of course. It just feels more open world to me than what Galaxy 2 did. And Galaxy 1 just did some things better. This game just did some things better than what Galaxy 2 did. Especially with like, uh, with the Combo Observatory and stuff. Uh, and stuff like that. I love the gravity mechanics in this game. Cause that's a cool thing I really love about the Galaxy series. That's why it's my favorite series for 3D platforming. No other Mario game has came close to how amazing this one is. Oh, this game's so magical. It is so awesome. And it's very acrobatic, too. This game's accessible to everybody. Like, anyone can play it. Like, like it's definitely a game anyone can play. Donkey Kong Country Returns is a little bit more complicated. And Donkey Kong Country Returns is a lot more difficult than this game. That's because this is a game you want to play. And there we go. Alright guys, that was it. Thank you very much for watching guys. If you did enjoy, don't forget to drop a like on the video. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to click on that subscribe button. And click on the bell right beside it to be notified every time my new videos come out. And let me know down in the comments below what is your favorite Wii game and why. And have a good one. Have a great day, guys. Peace out.